Hey, it's Quad. Welcome back to episode of Is It Worth It? So today's episode, we got this cool event right here. If you know what this is, it's a hair dryer or blow dryer. If you can see for the one that we got right here from this brand, and for this one in particular, they call it Swift. So this is what the package looks like when you guys do get in. Let me actually take out the wrapper and open it up to show you guys what the inside looks like. Once you guys do open it, you can see they do have the protection built inside. And once you guys do take it out, this is what the pot looks like. So for the one that I got in particular right here is a silver blue color. They do have this available in a few other colors as well. So you definitely want to do your own research to see what you prefer. But first, I'm actually take it out and show you guys what else is inside first. So in this first box right here, they probably guys want these accessory heads that in use. So that way when you guys do use it, the air is blowing directly in one direction and not all over the place, which is really nice. So here it actually looks like this side and here is our side. And they do have the brand name on there. And next up right here, we do have some paper. If you guys do take it out, inside they do probably guys a user manual to teach you guys how to set it up and how to use it. And then last but not least, we do have the actual product. So let's take it out from the box and also take off all the wrapper to show you guys what it looks like. So once you guys do take out the cable, if you can see the way how to design the cable definitely looks and feels like a high quality material. Like even for this part right here, you can see how it's all needs to wrap up. But let's take out the wrapper on here first to give you guys a better point of view of what the pot looks like. So once you guys do take out the wrapper, this is what the pot looks like. So right here is the front where the air is going to come out when you guys do use it. If you guys turn this side right here, they do have the brand name and they do have a few buttons. So this top switch is for you guys to turn it on and turn it off. And if you guys can see how there's two lines on here, one for low speed and one for high speed. And for this button right here is for you guys to press if you guys want to change the different temperature. There's pretty much three different temperature settings on here. Cold, warm, or hot. Blue would be cold, yellow would be warm, and red would be hot. And the way how I know which one is on is by looking at the side right here, it should light up, which I'll show you guys in a second. The bottom part right here is you have the filter option, and it is magnetic. So if you guys do open up, that is what the inside looks like. So I believe if you guys need to clean it, you guys can just open up to clean it if you guys do want to. But once you have it done, you can close it up. And it does have a really strong magnet to hold it in place, which is really nice. In terms of the cable, you can see it's actually designed really nicely. They do give you guys this option for you to strap it to organize it, which is really nice. And when you guys do feel the overall product, it doesn't feel heavy at all. It does feel pretty lightweight. So that is everything that's on the product. Before you test it out, I do want to go over some of the benefits of using product. So the first thing they mention when you guys do use it, it's supposed to be very fast and very efficient when you guys use it for drying your hair. Second thing they mention is the fact that it helps you guys fight frizz. So if your hair is very frizzy or whatever, it will help you guys with that as well, which is really nice. The third thing they mentioned is the fact that it's very quiet, which we'll test out in a second. The fourth thing that they mentioned about this product is the fact that how it actually has 200 million negative ion. So that way it can help you guys keep your hair shiny, smooth, and also prevent frizzy hair as well. And just like how I showed you guys earlier, they do have accessory head. So all you need to do is go like this, and it sticks it on because it does have a built-in magnetic option. And once you have it done, you have to take it out really easily. So very easy and very simple for us to use it. And for the cable, when you guys use it, they do have the test button and the reset button, just like any other product, in terms of blow dryer or hair dryer. But now let's plug it in to test it out to see how powerful it is and what the product sounds like when you guys do use it. So now that we got it plugged in, let's turn it on. So what I want to do is push it up one time to the low speed option. If you guys do increase it. If you guys can hear, when you guys do turn it on, it is really powerful and it's not loud compared to a lot of other blow dryer, which is pretty awesome. Usually for other blow dryer, it's much more louder than that, which is really cool. But if you guys notice how when we do turn it on, it does have a blue light on here. Let me actually turn it back on and show you guys what the different light looks like when you guys change it. So you can see how when you guys change the different color on here, it changed from blue to yellow to red. Let me bring this over to a different room to show you guys a better point of view of what the product looks like for the different light option. All right, so right here we do have the product. If you guys do turn it on. So that is blue, yellow, and red. Let me turn off the light and show you guys a better point of view. That's blue, yellow, and red. So that is what the product looks like when you guys do turn it on with a different color. All right, so now that I saw what the different color looks like, that is how you guys know which temperature you guys are using. Or when you guys are using the product, you guys can also feel which temperature you guys are using. Whether you guys feel cold air, warm air, or hot air. 
So just by doing that quick little test, it's actually pretty cool already because when you guys do feel the air that coming out, it's actually really powerful. Like if you guys do test it compared to like any other blow dryer or hair dryer, it's so loud. This one is literally so quiet, which is very impressive. So just to show you guys how powerful the wind is on here, let me actually try to blow this piece of paper. So let's do turn it on. That is high. If I turn it to low, that is low. So then see how powerful it is when you guys do use it. So especially for those guys who do have long hair, you can see how fast it can help you guys dry your hair when you guys do use it. And also when you guys use it, regardless if you guys use it in daytime or nighttime, you won't have to worry about disturbing your partner or anything because it's so quiet compared to your normal blow dryer, which is really awesome. And when you guys do feel it, It's literally so powerful, even on low. If I turn on high, high is like really powerful. It's literally so powerful that I can't even look at it compared to like when you guys use blow dryer, it's not that strong, which is really awesome. And if you guys know that the size of the pot is not that big, it's actually pretty small. So if you guys want to bring it along or you guys are traveling or something, you do have the option available. So that is everything that's on the pot. Now to go unboxing and test the pot. Now to answer the question of whether or not it's worth it or not. So for this product, I do have to say that it is pretty worth it if you guys want to need one of these, especially if you guys are in the market looking for a high quality blow dryer or hair dryer that's super powerful and not that loud. That also probably you guys the ease of cleaning it and putting different parts because it is magnetic like I'll show you guys. Then I do have to say that it is pretty worth it. But then obviously for those of you guys who don't want or don't need one or have one of these, that obviously don't buy one and save your money something else that you do need. So that's basically everything for this video itself. If you guys like this video, make sure to smash that like button in the bottom. That will definitely help this video out. And it will definitely help with the algorithm as well to promote more videos for you guys so you guys can see more of the videos or similar videos as well. But as always, make sure to stay positive, be you, and I'll see you guys in the next episode of Is It Worth It? Peace.